The day that I watched the news about OpenAI's real-time API, I said to myself, this new voice agent is really cool. It's going to change the AI community and how they interact with AI chatbots. Not long ago, I developed a voice assistant, but the experience was actually not very good. There are two main reasons. The first reason is AI's ability to understand. This part has been greatly improved after the release of LLM. And the second problem is the delay. Voice assistants usually go through three steps, convert user speech to text, use AI to process text and generate replies, and convert text replies to speech and play them on your device. One of the big problems I faced was delay, which leads to a poor user experience when the delay of human to human interaction can be controlled within hundreds or even tens of milliseconds, the bad experience will disappear and will be replaced by better user experience and product value. With the development of the real-time API, I think there will be a new dawn for voice assistants, not to mention that it is really a brain work to integrate all these technologies seamlessly to create a human-like interactive experience. However, here's the good news, with transformative extensions, network, developers no longer have to rack their brains. TEN is a real-time voice agent framework for creating conversational AI agents. It not only reduces development pain points, but also makes it easy to interrupt conversations with the TEN agent and seamlessly build the next generation of AI applications from scratch. So let me give you a quick demo of a live chatbot to show you what I mean. I went to the 10 agent GitHub page and clicked the link to explore the chatbot demo. I selected an agent demo, which included options like voice agent Gemini, a voice agent with Defy, a custom text to speech and speech to text and a voice storyteller with an image generator. After selecting the demo, I chose English as the conversation language by default, even after selecting a default language. 10 can still understand other languages, then I clicked on a small icon to configure greeting messages and prompts to create AI tutor assistance. Finally, I clicked connect to start the conversation. Stay tuned until the end because I will show you how to building your own voice agent with local deployment. When I started chatting with the agent, the voice agent used automatic voice detection to determine when I finished speaking, ensuring the interaction felt natural the agent then converted the audio into text to achieve high quality semantic understanding with faster real time performance. Next, the agent used an LLM to understand the user's intent and generate natural answer text. During this process, the agent planned the reasoning steps to break down the problem. Finally, the agent took the output and converted the text into natural speech. In this video, I'll quickly go over the document so you are 100% up to speed on what 10 agent is, what it features, how it works, and even will be installing applications on screen that you can copy, paste, and adapt for your uses. The 10 framework is an open source tool that helps developers quickly create real-time multimodal agents. These agents can work with voice, video, data streams, images, and text. It makes it simple for developers to try out ideas, use large language models, and build features they can reuse. With 10, you can create voice chatbots, AI tools for meeting notes, language learning apps, and much more. 10 makes it easy for you. It gives you various AI tools and features to design, test, and launch advanced AI agents that can think, listen, see, and interact in real time. The system offers multimodal interaction, supporting voice, text, and images for natural human computer communication, making it ideal for applications like intelligent customer service and real time voice assistance. It integrates RCT technology for low latency voice and video interaction, ensuring a smooth user experience without additional configuration. With extensive features, Users can access weather queries, web searches, visual recognition, real-time agent state management enables dynamic responses, while support for both edge computing and cloud deployment ensures flexibility across different scenarios, and pre-built modules for speech-to-text, large language models, and text-to-speech allow quick iteration with ready-to-use extensions and customizable options for developers. Definitely stay tuned throughout the end of this video. If you guys haven't followed me, I highly recommend that you do so, so you can stay up to date with the latest AI news. Lastly, 
make sure you guys subscribe, turn the notification bell, like this video and check out previous videos because there is a lot of content that you will definitely benefit from. So that thought, let's get right back into the video. The 10 agents architecture has four extensions, automatic speech recognition extension, large language model extension, text to speech extension and RTC extension. The 10 framework is based on extensions, which can be built in different programming languages and combined to create apps. A graph in the 10 framework shows how data moves between extensions. It controls data flow and defines connections. For example, it can send speech to text output to a large language model for further processing. When you start a conversation with an agent, you can use audio, video, or screenshots in a real-time communication network. The RTC network acts like a highway carrying data to the backend server. And real-time messaging is an SDK that allows you to send instant signaling messages. When you start speaking, the agent needs to know when you finished. It uses voice automatic detection, interrupt detector, to identify when the audio ends. Once the audio is detected, the system collects the message and converts it into text using DeepGram. The text is then passed to a large language model to process and generate an output. The response is converted back into speech using 11 labs, text to speech. Finally, when the agent completes its task, the response travels back through the RTC network to the user's app. Everything is managed by the 10 manager, which handles tasks like uploading, sharing, and installing extensions. It automatically manages dependencies and their environment. This makes installing and publishing extensions easy, helping developers work more efficiently in the 10 framework. Let's run the 10 agent together before we start. Make sure you have Docker and Docker Compose installed, obtain the Agora app ID and app certificate. If the certificate is enabled in the Agora console and get an OpenAI API key, as well as API keys for DeepGram ASR and Fish Audio TTS. Once you've prepared all the APIs, we open the terminal and clone down the 10 agent repository in the project root directory Use copy.env.example.env, the command to create .env a file, open .env in the file and fill in the required API key and configuration. Start the container, run the command in the project root directory, docker compose up to start the container, or docker compose up dash D, start the container in detached mode using the command. After that, we open another window in the same env, enter the container and build the agent. Once you run Docker successfully, you will see the app in your terminal to start building the app. We use task use. Once the build is complete, run the server on port 8080. We use task run, open it in your browser, localhost 3000 to start using 10 agent. Once the browser opens, we will select a graph. There are different types available. Voice assistant, voice assistant real time and storyteller. What draws my attention is storyteller which is a use case for developers who want to build a storyteller with voice interaction quickly. They can directly use it and customize it. Our roadmap also has more use cases such as computer use, virtual beings with avatars, and PSTN for phones. First, we customize our extension modules. In this video, we will use DeepGram for speech to text and a large language model to process our data. And we have a function call where we use tools like Bing Search or a vision tool Finally, we will use 11 labs for text to speech, but feel free to customize them based on your preferences. Once you save the changes, let's connect the agent and test our chatbot. But let me tell you what surprised me when I played with 10 agent. I think many of us will like it because they have this cool feature where you can have a conversation with a customized avatar. If you're as curious as I was, give me a few seconds of your time to show you what I mean. In this demo, you'll see one of 10 agents team members having a conversation with an avatar, asking her to dance and even change the music and background. Not only that, but they also made another demo with a different dog avatar where he asked the avatar to change his accent. But here's the kicker. 10's graph designer is an excellent tool for designing conversation flows with a drag and drop interface. It connects to a property.json and manifest.json file in the backend, where we use Demuxus, Muxus, and FFmpeg to manage and work with video and audio files. We use Demuxer. If you only want the audio from a video file, you need a Demuxer and Muxer. If you edit a video and add new audio, 
We use a muxer to package them together. We also use FMPEG to extract audio, combine streams, or even convert the file to a different format. This feature will be launched soon. Guys, this project is really awesome. I've always thought about creating something like this, but when I found 10 Agent, it helped me a lot and saved me time. I can mimic the project and adapt it for our use case. It's definitely worth giving it a GitHub star to support open source and useful content. In fact, after a short experience, I really want to shout, all agents need 10 agent real time. 10 agent is not only a powerful multimodal AI agent framework, but also provides developers with powerful tools to build efficient real time interactive applications. Its rich functions and flexible application scenarios make it an ideal choice for enterprises and individual developers to build the next generation of voice AI applications.